Hi everybody and welcome to Orthodoxy 101. Well, in our continuing series on priestly vestments, today we're going to begin to look at liturgical vestments. Remember, we've already looked at the non-liturgical vestments, but today what we're going to look at is vestments that are predominantly used during the conduct of the divine liturgy. So we're going to begin by looking at a garment called the stechadion. Now, first off, before I begin, let's review very quickly. Originally, all of the vestments represented events during Christ's Passion Week. And over time, the vestments evolved into other meanings. But their original meaning was what they represented during Christ's Passion Week. The stichadion is one that has held on to that because it represents now the seamless tunic that was won by Christ and that the soldiers at their crucifixion were gambling or playing dice over. So what you see in the stichadion is now a more loose-fitting garment, high collar, and usually some embroidery here at the top. The sleeves fit fairly closely as they would in the Anderi, but you'll notice here the cord at the end is meant now to wrap around the sleeves, tighten them up so that when I put the cuffs on, it will fit very nicely. Now, I know that some people say that the stichadion is typically white and that's biblical. You'll notice here, that's not always the case. So in this case, we have gold. There's others that will have more of a lavender color. And again, sometimes it matches the vestments that the priest is wearing. But typically speaking, most of the stichadia that you'll see will be white in color. Now, each vestment, as it's being put on by the priest, has a particular prayer that is read. And in that prayer, you will hear the symbolic meaning that is evolved for that piece of vestment. So let me read that to you for the stichadion. My soul shall rejoice in the Lord, for he has clothed me with a garment of righteousness and has covered me with a robe of gladness. He has crowned me as a bridegroom and he has adorned me as a bride with jewels always now and forever into the ages of ages. Amen. So thanks for watching and join us next week when I'll put on the next piece of liturgical vestments. So remember, like, share, subscribe. We'll see you soon.